Well, Uber was just hit with a fat, massive new lawsuit. You don't want to miss this video. We got a lot to cover today. Uber's head of rides just left the company. Uber's stock is plummeting as drivers are protesting, striking nationwide for better pay. Uber ends its fuel surcharge for Uber Eats drivers. Uber rideshare drivers could be next. DoorDash ends its fuel surcharge, as well as a lot of other updates. Please thumbs up the video. We're talking about a lot today. We're doing a deep dive into Uber, and I wanna hear from you guys. Are you happy? Do you think Uber and Lyft drivers are getting paid enough right now? Are you driving for rideshare? Are you doing food delivery? All right, so before I get started, I wanna tell you all about a new insurance company called Buckle, and they are uh, specifically for gig workers. So if you uh, drive for Uber, Lyft, any of the food delivery platforms you qualify, they only accept gig workers, which is awesome. And they could potentially save you tons of money uh, both on your policy and when you get into an accident because they're gonna make sure that you are covered in the case of, you know, you get into an accident while you're driving rideshare. So uh, I have a link below. When you get a free quote, they're gonna give you a $20 Visa gift card. So take advantage of that offer now because it might not last very long. And they give you $5 when you sign up to be a member. And yes, it does work nationwide. I heard a lot of comments. Oh, it's only available in like four states. No, you can become a member nationwide. So check the link out. Okay, here we go. Uber hit with trademark lawsuit. Listen to this. Did you guys know that Uber is getting into travel services? Uber hit with trademark lawsuit over new travel services. Uber RE for real estate said, Uber Technologies plans to expand into travel booking. Rideshare Giants plan allegedly infringes real estate's company's trademark. California company sued Uber Technologies. Good job for actually, you know, going after the big giants. It's like David versus Goliath out there. Imagine going up against a multi-billion dollar company. Uh, but yeah, this California company sued Uber in federal court on Thursday, accusing the rideshare giant of violating its trademark rights with a new Uber travel trademark application services that would unfairly compete with its real estate business. Uber RE Inc's lawsuit said it bought an Uber trademark for real estate services in 2017 and uses the name on software for booking travel accommodations. Wow. It claimed damages of over $250 billion. Guys, this, this could actually shut Uber down. Oh my gosh. Uh, that's because 250 billion bucks is more than five times Uber Technologies' current market cap. Uber Technologies did not immediately respond to a request for comment. Uber RE advertises vacation rentals through an Uber BNB app. To be honest, I think Uber BNB almost sounds like it's infringing on Airbnb's trademark. I mean, Uber's really like, you know, flipping a coin with these new companies that they're starting. They didn't realize, and especially with their naming of this all. Uber RE Inc. Chairman Brett Rentz told routers that Uber Technologies had breached an agreement with the company that he declined to detail. Wow. Holy smokes, guys. So, I don't know, guys. Uber is not doing too well right now, and this lawsuit could potentially mean the end of Uber. So, if you're an Uber driver, might start thinking about driving for Lyft, okay? Use my sign-up code for get a sign-up bonus. Hey, see what I did there? <laughs> All right, guys. Thanks for watching today's video. Again, if you do want to sign up for that rideshare insurance company, check out the link below. They'll help you get started in a few minutes. Uh, it could save you tons of money. Otherwise, I'll talk to you soon. Bye now.